today. We have had uh, quite the journey, been in several airports, and finally made our way to Krakow in Poland, and then rented an SUV, and uh, we're now approaching the Polish-Ukrainian border. Uh, of course, right now, which I don't even know what day it is right now, uh, but right now, Vladimir Putin and the Russians uh, have invaded Ukraine and are trying to take it over. Uh, and that has led to the largest refugee crisis on this continent since World War II. So my, my son and I have traveled over here uh, to try and help in whatever way we can. Uh, several different things that we're looking at, at doing, but one of them is working with World Central Kitchen uh, at feeding people as they are coming across the border. Um, you know, a lot of them are making a, a pretty long journey, and it is 24 hours a day that, that they are coming across uh, looking for uh, sanctuary and, and looking for refuge. So that's one of the things that we're going to be doing, and then there's some other things that, that we might be tied in with as well, uh, helping these people as they are escaping uh, the, the violence that has descended upon uh, upon their homes and upon their towns. Uh, but anyway, the, the place that we're heading to right now is called uh, Medica. We, we just stopped at World Central Kitchen's um, field headquarters um, here close to the border. And then they've also got... Uh, In half a mile, turn left toward Rodemno. They've also got a place staged up. Uh, where they're helping these people immediately as they're crossing. So, take a look and uh, see what we're getting into. In half a mile, turn right onto Medica. All right, uh, just made it here to the border crossing. So, uh, just over there in the distance is Ukraine. And, uh, uh, this this is not going to be fancy at all. I'm just going to kind of show things uh, as they are happening here. And I've really struggled <laughs> with whether I uh, want to do this or not. Uh, but I've been encouraged by a lot of friends to maybe show a few things so that people know uh, what's going on here. Uh, and, and also so that uh, people can see like the human consequences uh, whenever a, a tyrant like Putin is is allowed to uh, do what he's doing right now and I also want to show how, how good people are uh, in in the face of evil so um, hopefully this is taken well it's it's being done with the best of intentions and uh, anything that is is like too much I, I won't show um, but anyway we're going to uh, jump over here and see see what's going on so uh, as you can see it's kind of a tent city that has been set up here and there's a guy who has uh, brought his piano and is uh, playing music for the people as they are making their way across the border that's pretty cool and then uh, this right here is just kind of a collection center where people have brought clothes blankets that people can uh, can pick up Right here they have a little center where mothers coming through with young kids can pick up diapers or formula or you know different things for their babies. Thank you. 
Right up there is the border between Poland and Ukraine. So this is the entry point where uh, all the people who are fleeing the violence are coming through. Some people are doing pretty well. Some people come across and are in tears. Uh, pretty sad situation all around. All right, uh, so there's just a, a quick glimpse at uh, the area that we're going to be working in uh, as these people are coming across the border. And uh, our, our main objective is to, to work, um, but if there's some downtime, I might show some things here and there uh, as uh, things progress.